So let's explain the difference between the macro states and the macro states. So it's a macro states and macro states. So what are those? So it's uh, properties. Like a, it's a method uh, like two parameters uh, we use to study various properties associated with uh, a system, like various systems to get different different properties. We use this two to study them. So um, this two, both are two types of arrangements, um, while the macro state, macro state, which is this one, is a possible internal arrangement. Define it as a state of which the motions of the discrete particles are in entirely state, subject uh, for sure. Uh, the inescapable restrictions enforced by the uncertainty principle of quantum mechanics. Me mechanics. Uh, macro state, which is this one, uh, is a possible external arrangement defined by stating so it's a external arrangement so it's just, it decro describe an external arrangement uh like by stating the external parameters so any other construct uh, constrictions to which the system is subject so uh for a sense on dealing with an isolated system, um, which uh, which does not exchange heat or walk with its surroundings, and then the macro state may be state by giving the values of volume and constant total energy, which is also macro um, state. So in general, the number of macro state, which this one, I'm talking this one now, a uh, social way is greater than the number of macro states associated with the particular particular arrangement. So basically, one is the internal arrangement, and the other one is external arrangement, uh, which should describe isolated system. The property of uh, isolated system, like volume or total energy, 